Right guys, welcome back to another episode of the Chelsea Career Mode. <clears throat> so today we're into our first like proper month of the season, no transfer window, straight games and it's kind of tough. We have Wolves away to open up, which I, when I saw, thought, okay, gonna have to play that. I can't, lads, because we need to open our Champions League campaign with a win. And then we also play Liverpool, who are title rivals this year. And so we've got to play that one. And then Brighton at home, of course, should be a simmable game. So that's the plan for today's episode. But first, let's have a look into the career challenges. So a forfeit has been added for the Young Lions objective. And that is, if we fail... We have to buy the oldest English player in the game in our next career mode and play him for 10 games. I'm going to be honest, I don't see it happening because we're already on 7 out of 15 now. I checked at the end of the last episode, it's crazy. We're getting score points with English players 23 and under all over the place. You know, Reese James has a goal and assist. Mason Mount has like 2 goals and an assist, I think. Hudson Adoy has 2 goals. Lewis Baker has a goal. There's goals and assists flying everywhere, lads. So that one's going to be quite easy, I think. Um, now, the next one I've called the 0405 objective. And I actually seen this on the internet the other day. Um, some sports page had it up that in 2004 2005, Chelsea conceded just fifth, I think it was maybe 14 goals in the league. Our objective, and this is going to be a tough one, concede 14 or less goals in the league. Going to be basically impossible, I think. As of yet, there's no forfeit attached to that one, so let me know. Um, basically, you know, think about it, because whatever forfeit you put on that, it's likely I'm going to have to do it, because I don't think we're going to go the whole season conceding 14 or less goals, but we'll try our best, lads. So lads, I'm simming through to um, the Wolves game and we're getting offers for William. I'm going to put this up to 15.5 million. Barcelona are coming in. Obviously I'm going to accept, I still want to sell them. But I'm simming forward to Wolves here. And as you can see, we're just getting offers. We're getting offers and offers. So I'm just delegating at this point lads because this isn't the transfer window episode so I don't want it to be that so hopefully okay Barcelona have pulled out already good for them and Giroud has been sold that's good I wanted rid of him and Milan have pay, agreed to pay 19.4 million for Willian he can go. Giroud has been sold to Monaco for nine and a half million. That's good. Um, an all player I didn't really want the round to be honest. Here we have Wolves. Marcus, your place has been taken, mate. We brought in Alex Tellez. Unfortunately, we have to send this, lads. And I'm just looking before we go in here. We've conceded two goals so far, so it's good. But it's kind of scary when you think about it. We can only concede 12 more goals the rest of the season, which is mad. How's this game going to go? 2-1 win. Again, more goals. Like It's going to be scary every time we send a game. we got to keep clean sheets coming in. And as you can see, lads, the Champions League screen coming up. We're going to be... Hopefully getting our Champions League campaign off to a good start. With this game against Valencia, Alonso. Yeah, oh, that's a different thing. Shirt sales, great. Alonso. Yeah, I mean, you've kind of lost your place, bro. You're a backup now. It's a tough enough group. I'll admit that. It actually is quite tough. And we're going to attend the press conference and get the lads hyped up for the game. 
so Ryan, <laughs> it'll prove he's the right man. I don't think Matty Ryan's going to be playing just yet. We've been waiting for this fixture. <clears throat> and yeah, we are not affected. You know, 1-0, 10-0. <laughs> three points is three points. A win is a win, lads. So let's get into it. Here we are, lads. First Champions League group game at Stamford Bridge. I swear, this happens like all the time. Trainers on, why? Like, yeah, I know I'm on the like I'm on a different account here. I'm not on my main account for these careers. But like, come on. I've been playing the game so long. I know the controls by now. I was pull a quitter. That's actually a good ball. I have to pull a sitch. That's why. That's poor, mate. They're coming at us, lads. It's a good save from Kappa. That's an important one. Corner right in front of the Valencia fans. They've hit the bar. Lads, we need to get that out. It's another corner. This isn't good. This is mad. Kepa holds it again. Left forward. It's a good ball from Kovacic. Out to Pulisic. He finds Tellez. He needs support. Finds Ndidi! Wilfred Ndidi! Let's go, son! Of all people, it's Wilfred Ndidi! I have to say, I liked what I've seen from Alex Tellez here. This is brilliant. It's Ndidi from CDM getting himself forward, getting into the box and getting the goal. Absolutely brilliant. 1-0 up here, lads. 25 minutes gone. Important goal. Again. Gets it to Batshuayi. He took the shot early. Maybe had more space to run into. Just didn't realise it at the time. That's a good ball. Oh my days, lads. That's disappointing from the defence. They've got to be clearing that. I mean, it was a decent enough ball, I guess, but... You expect one of our defenders to be winning that. And Gonzalo Guedes levels it before half-time. So lads, 73 minutes. This is the first time the balls basically went out, which is so annoying, but we need subs. Hudson and Doyle's coming in. Daniel Mallon is coming in. I'm gonna give Van de Beek his debut for Kovacic. Hudson and Doy, he's picked it up. Go on, son. He's done well. He's found Malin. Why did Van de Beek run away from that? Side to Pulisic. Oh my lord. Get us. No. Gonzalo oh. Get us is. Ruined us single handedly tonight, lads. Pulisic gets it in. Hudson. What was that? Why have you took that on your left foot? All you had to do, right foot on the volley, top corner. Instead, you've done that. Hudson Adoy, play this right, mate. Back post. It's a corner. I don't want to cross this in because I know it won't work straight from here. 
Rudiger. Da Costa. No. Why is there friggin' 50 people in front of me? <sighs> Beaten in our first group game. Forget winning the Champions League. We're gonna be lucky if we friggin' win the Europa League playing like this. So, after being demolished by Valencia, not even demolished by Valencia, demolished by Gonzalo Guedes. After that, their disappointment, we're back in Premier League action. Against Liverpool, it's gonna be another tough one, but Mane coming forward. We're in trouble. Kante has gone sliding in. Thankfully, Mane puts it into the side netting. Oh my, Henderson has just got in front of that. Mane, what a save. Oh my word, what a save. Well, yeah, though, this isn't good. We're being dominated. So, oh no. So that puts it in. I mean, it's been common, but. Oh my word, it's 2 0. Right, we need subs, lads, right now. Ziyech. I'll try something else. I'll try something else. I want to change to four triple two lads. And Hudson and Doyle and Mount in there. Batshuayi and Malin. Perfect, let's go. This isn't good. Oh my word, it's three. Maybe no score. We destroyed these in four one in the Super Cup. And now we're three 0 down. What has happened? I will not concede less than 14 goals this season, no chance. What an awful, awful performance. Post-match press conference, we've gone in. Do you seriously think I care about playing backup Matthew Ryan? Seize any opportunity. No, we should have kept it going. Screw the team. They're, they were crap today. I'm not going to sit there and praise them. Just to keep the morale up. Well, he's been sold. Oh, this is actually the EFL Cup. Oh, wait. It's been added in. Right, well, it doesn't matter because we're summoning it as well. Both against Brighton. Simming both. Are we going to get a cup run? We are. 2-0. Pulisic and Vatshuayi. And then the league, we are third, but still a long way off top. What's this gonna be? 4-1. We can see the game. I think that, like, that objective is impossible, lads. It is impossible. Ajax and Valencia both won their games, so. We have a big task ahead of us in the Champions League. I'm stupid. I actually should have played Matty Ryan in the um, AFL Cup there against Brighton just to get them to shut up about them. But sure, what can you do? That's it for today's episode, boys. Disappointing one. We were just outplayed twice. So yeah, thanks for watching. I'll see you next time. Cheers.